Daniel Coyle, The Culture Code, The Secrets of Highly Successful Groups Welcome to the fascinating world of group culture, where the dynamics of interaction hold the key to success. In The Culture Code, The Secrets of Highly Successful Groups, author Daniel Coyle takes us on a journey to explore the intricacies of group behavior and how a positive, cooperative environment yields optimal results, often outshining sheer expertise or experience. Stretching from examining safety and vulnerability in groups to the importance of shared purpose, this book summary delves deep into the factors that contribute to effective and successful team dynamics. Prepare to enrich your understanding of group culture and unlock the secrets to creating thriving, high-achieving groups. Group Culture Fundamentals Every group has a unique culture based on the relationships among its members. Dysfunctional group cultures stem from a focus on individual status rather than quality interaction. The key to success lies in cooperation, as exhibited by a group of kindergartners who won a competition through experimentation and teamwork. Safety breeds success. Feeling safe and comfortable in a group setting is crucial in achieving success, as evidenced by studies by Will Phelps and Alex Pentland. Safety ultimately comes down to familiarity and connections, and a strong group culture that nurtures this leads to stronger individual performances. In Phelps' study, a member's positive attitude helped their group perform well despite the presence of a bad apple trying to obstruct progress. In Pentland's study, paying attention to belonging cues like eye contact and physical proximity allowed him to predict the outcome of bargaining sessions. Creating a safe environment. Building a safe environment requires active listening, letting people see your weaknesses, and avoiding interruptions. By interjecting with linguistic markers and nonverbal cues, you can foster a sense of belonging and safety. Admitting your own imperfections and asking for input can also put others at ease. The power of vulnerability. It may seem counterintuitive, but sharing your vulnerabilities is key to group performance. Admitting weaknesses and mistakes creates a feedback loop that generates trust and closeness among group members. Various studies have confirmed this connection between vulnerability and cooperation. For example, in a simulated plane crash, crew members were able to work together to save almost 200 lives because the pilot admitted his vulnerability and allowed others to ask for help. In a study conducted by David Desteno, participants who experienced a moment of vulnerability were more willing to cooperate with others. So, the next time you interact with others, remember that being vulnerable can actually make you a better team player. Building Strong Teams Cooperation and vulnerability are key factors in building a successful team. Leaders must be willing to admit their weaknesses and encourage their team members to do the same. IDEO and Danny Meyer's approach of fostering a collaborative and open environment has led to their success. To build a strong team, it's important to establish a culture of cooperation. This means communicating the expectation that team members should work together and rely on one another. Leaders must also lead by example and be willing to show their vulnerabilities. Tim Brown, the head of IDEO, emphasizes this philosophy of cooperation at the start of each assignment, which has contributed to their success. Leaders play a crucial role in creating a safe environment for team members to be open and vulnerable. By admitting their mistakes and imperfections, they encourage their team members to do the same. Danny Meyer, a successful restaurateur, exemplifies this by sharing his challenges and thanking his colleagues for their help. Overall, building a strong team requires a culture of cooperation, vulnerability, and leadership by example. Organizations like IDEO and successful leaders like Danny Meyer have demonstrated the effectiveness of this approach. The Power of Shared Purpose Groups that share a common sense of purpose perform better. This is because a shared sense of purpose provides group members with a common stock of ideas and aligns their behavior. Companies often create high-purpose environments to guide the actions of group members. These environments are filled with signals that connect members with a shared future goal, much like a bridge spanning the present and future. 
Storytelling is a powerful tool that can be used to motivate groups to pursue shared goals. The power of repetition and catchphrases in establishing company purpose. Establishing a clear purpose for a company is not an overnight process and requires repetition, open communication, and catchy phrases. Repetition is essential to ensure a shared sense of purpose and clarity among team members. Companies should not assume that their priorities have been communicated clearly without repetition. Regular meetings should be held to encourage open discussion and reflection on the company's goals. Johnson & Johnson effectively uses this approach. Catchphrases are also useful for boosting awareness of a company's core values. While they may seem cheesy, they serve as useful reminders of what a company stands for. In conclusion, The Culture Code offers insightful observations and practical advice on fostering a thriving group culture. The key lessons include recognizing the importance of safety and belonging cues in groups, admitting and sharing vulnerability to build trust and cooperation, and fostering a shared sense of purpose to ensure goal alignment and team motivation. Through understanding these vital group elements and implementing the strategies outlined in this book, you can transform any group regardless of its size or context, into a successful, high-performance team. So, embrace the knowledge shared within these pages and unlock the true potential of your group interactions.